Hey, what's going on, everybody? Isaac here. It is Sog Sunday. It's my buddy, the Sog Grunt, always posts, and sometimes I jump in and post one as well just for fun and to give him a little shout out there. He's got a huge Sog collection. I got a little bit one and always find myself wanting to carry this one. <coughs> It's one of the first SOG knives I got. I believe the second SOG knife I ever got. It was the first one I wanted. But then I saw a pretty sweet deal at Cabela's for the Ace fixed blade. It's, it's a cheap budget fixed blade. And it came with a Mac V multi-tool for just 20 bucks. So I bought that one day when I was in there. But this is the one I wanted. It's a Seal XR. It's a hair under four inch blade. Beefy, three sixteenths of an inch thick. I've done a ton of videos on this knife and shown it a bunch of times because it's just one of my favorites. One of my favorites of all time here. And I've had it for three years and it's great. Um, the coating, well, eh. That's, that's too little to cut. <laughs> the coating is held up great. I don't even hardly have any scratches in it. Uh, it's a Cerakote and the blade. So I had the, the OG original version of the CLXR that does not have the made in the USA markings because in the original run, just the blade was made in the USA and the other parts in Taiwan where a lot of SOG products are made. But now, you know, they decided logistically it's just easier to do it all in the U.S. And it's nice because they can put that excellent made in the USA mark on the blade. They've got a new version coming out this year. Hopefully in May is what SOG told me of the CLXR Titanium where the liners are switched from, you know, whatever steel they use to titanium to lighten it up a little bit, uh, like an ounce, ounce and a half, something like that, uh, not like in half or anything. But, you know, when something's eight or nine ounces, I forget the exact weight of this knife, um, you know, under 10 ounces, and you take, you know, one ounce away, you, you can feel that difference. And they are putting the magnet cut steel in the blade instead of the s35 vn because magnet cut is hot s35 vn is fine with me in my opinion they should have done an upgrade in the handle scales from the grn to g10 or micarta or something but there you go sog sunday I do got my SOG tactical shirt on, but it's a little chilly, so I'm wearing my hoodie here. Until next Sunday. SOG out. <laughs>